Okay, continuing with our figure here, we're going to work on this belt a little bit. Uh, I'm going to use a little bit of a gray on this belt to uh, work on it. And then, it, and I don't paint the buckle gray. I'm just going to paint the the belt side gray. Now, if you really want to make it realistic, you can take and, and whittle you a little knife or something like that and, and put it on his belt. Uh, that, that's always nice, you know, a little knife in a scabbard or something like that. Uh, just, just little different ideas that you can use. To, uh, I could have done that, but I, I didn't because of time. Uh, whittle you a little knife in a scabbard and just glue it on his belt there. and. Uh, that would be a nice little addition. I've done that with uh, with a uh, several of these little characters. That's always a neat addition to your uh, your character here. Okay, see? There we go. Got a little place on my burn umber I need to do. And if you get a little gray on your burn umber, that's no problem. You just come back and you and you hit it again. See? A little gray on the belt. Now, what I'm going to do when it comes to the belt buckle. not that um, now like I said your combination of colors do not have to be this don't feel that you have to go when, when, it, when it comes to the carving it's pretty good to follow pretty closely but when it comes to the painting, uh, a lot of you are a lot better painters than I am, and you can do a lot better job. And you just experiment and do what you think. So, all right, there we go. Now, we're going to work on the shirt. And I, I thought I would do the shirt. Like I said, when it comes to the shirt, you do whatever you want to. You can make it blue or whatever. I'm going to go with the red oxide on the shirt right here. I like red oxide. I don't know, I just I like a, a red shirt, even though I don't wear them. Um, I like, you know, somebody else to wear them, but not me. Texas, we don't we don't wear. <laughs> We're, we're not your, your snappy dressers, perhaps, that we are, that people are up north. People that live on the coast down here, where I am, we, we're, uh, we work in refineries, uh, or we work in a lot of industry. And we're not, uh, we're, we're very hard, hard-working people, but um, we're not uh, socialites, as we might say. And I'm, not, I'm sure maybe maybe a lot of you are not. Most wood carvers are not what you would call socialites. And I'm not. Uh, uh, please, I'm not. Uh, if you are a socialite, please don't. Uh, but 
I, it's hard to see a guy in a tuxedo sitting there uh, um, whittling. Uh, <laughs> a little bit out of character, as we might say. But most of us down in this area, we, we work in refineries and <clears throat> we work in the industry. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, so we're not, as you might say, refined people from Texas. Uh, of course, there's many, many parts of Texas. Texas is a huge state. Uh, one of the things when I was driving up north, uh, when I went to Pennsylvania to visit my aunt in beautiful country, Pennsylvania, but one of the things I realized that I could drive from Pennsylvania across Pennsylvania, you know, pretty quickly. Uh, where Texas, it uh, if you start from one end of Texas and drive, it'll take you two days to drive clear across Texas. In other words, and uh, uh, it's a very big state. So uh, now where I'm at, where I live, I'm not far from the Louisiana border. So I'm in Louisiana in 45 minutes. But uh, uh, if you started from one end of Texas and drove all all, all over, well, you would definitely be uh, at least close to a two-day drive. So uh, Texas is a very big state. Um, there we go. We're looking good in here. It's a very, very big state, and I've lived here all my life. And it's a good state. It is. And um, But it's like any other state. A lot of people say our states are different. And, but I, I think, and, and of course, our states are different because of industries or because of, uh, like Florida, uh, tourism. Uh, is has to do a lot with Florida. There's not a lot of industry in Florida. Um, not like the industry that we have down here. Uh, oil and production, chemical production. But uh, I love to go to Florida. My wife uh, came from Florida, Destin, Florida. 